guys. So for today's intro, I'm sorry, but Loki's just not gonna be in this one. I had to put him up in his kennel just because I have a lot of little things here that I feel like he'll try to grab and go swallow. I'm simply blown away. I'm still like trying to process and think of like the right words to say, but I'm just blown away by the sh <laughs> you guys going over to my daughter's brand new YouTube channel, showing her so much love, all the comments, all the thumbs up. I just, she's in, she's in shock, honestly. She uh, sent me a snap this morning and she was just like, oh my God, I have over 3000 subscribers. <laughs> and she just posted a video yesterday. So um, yeah, so we're both just like shocked, but thank you so much. And um, she's gonna be, I think she's already filmed more content, so um, I don't really know, again, like what her schedule and what her whole vibe and all that's gonna be. That's all her. Um, but just thank you. And if you didn't know, my daughter just started a YouTube channel. I'll link it down below for you. So anyways, um, actually she started laughing. We, um, we were on FaceTime and we were reading comments together. Um, and she was like, the number of comments of people wanting me to open up care packages um, was really hilarious because I just sent her her Easter care package. And if you missed that video, I'll link it down below. You can watch that tutorial of how I put it together. And um, I think she should get it today. So I don't know like if that's something that she'll want to film or not, but we were laughing at like how many like requests and comments there were about it. So this haul does have Easter stuff, but not for my daughter because I already did it again in the form of a care package. So I got some things for my niece and nephew. And I wanted to show you guys this. These are the Easter baskets I decided to go with from Dollar Tree. I hauled quite a few different ones and I wasn't sure which route I was gonna go, but I am gonna go with these. So let's just jump in. So the first thing I got my nephew this toy. I thought it was just so cute. It's a three car garage. He is seven months old, but you know, and it it's like two plus and I'm sure there's like a whole reason for that. So they can save it or, um, you know, just kind of like let him push the buttons or whatever. But I thought it was really cute. Here's what it looks like. Obviously it's not gonna fit in here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wrap some of the things. So I grabbed this wrapping paper from TJ Maxx. I liked the pastels. I thought it was really pretty and fun and Eastery. This one, a little fairy boat, which the packaging is really cute. I like the cardboard box look. It just has a retro look to it. I really like that. You can actually put this whole thing apparently in the dishwasher. And then there's even a working ramp. So load up the cars. All right, then I got this little toy for my niece. I did get her a ton of stuff from Dollar Tree. It's all upstairs. So I'm gonna have to like finesse this somehow. Um, but I also do keep quite a bit here cause she'll come and play. But this is Sophie 16, little pet, wash the dog, that whole thing. So I got that for her. And then for my nephew, I got this little mover and shaker. You can see the little image there of the baby playing. So super cute. Obviously a little bit more age appropriate for him. Three months. Wow. I have vibrates quite a bit. But I got this little controller. Six months plus. So this one's great for him now. It is my first learning controller. Then I got him this little flip book, little jungle book. Oh, it's this way. This was $3.99, has all these little like sensory bits for them and the crinkly sounds. Super cute, I mean $3.99, like what? Now this item, I searched high and low at TJ Maxx, hoping I was going to find more. So I'm going to have to look on Amazon and see what I can find. And I was trying to find more of the cars, is what I was trying to do. This was $3.99. Like, what? So, super cute. This looks like the, it's called, it's the Icy Roller. Yeah. 
So with Shopkins, what I love about them is like every little bit and bobble has some sort of very cute name. So that's going to go in her Easter basket. And then I always have to get a book of some sort. So I got my nephew this book for $4.99. It says, You Are My I Love You. So, and he is, I love him to just pieces. So there's that. And then also for my nephew, I got Baby's First Squeeze Teether. Very interesting, like a very unique twist on a teething ring, I guess you could say. This is $4.99. Yeah, $4.99, super cute. They even had like another little animal. Has like a little squeaky bit, but apparently they can chomp on it. So there's that. This I'm very excited about. It's for my niece and it just, you guys, this took me back to the 80s. Here's the price, $3.99. But it comes with, what, four, four bracelets and three necklaces. And like I said, this just took me back so hard to the 80s. And you know, this was what our jewelry looked like. Um, and I just was like, okay, immediately in my car, it's like a little My Little Pony thing. My niece is the girliest girl I've ever seen in my life. Like she has, she dresses herself now. So she puts in not only her bow, but she puts in several clips everywhere. Um, she's, she's, she's got to do the works head to toe. She's four. So I just know she's going to love this and I would have honestly like look at this one with the pearls I would have honestly have gotten more if they had like a different set but they only had like the same of let's see is that it for toys for them because next up I have clothes but yeah I think that's it for toys um just random but at the checkout you know how it is at TJ Maxx. I saw these milk chocolate sea salt caramel pecan clusters. Do you say pecan or pecan? Next up, I'll show you. I got one item for myself, which... <laughs> hey, it's a hat this time. It's not a mug. There are, as a matter of fact, there are no mugs, I don't think, in this haul. So there's that. And there was no way I was going to walk away from this gorgeous little tie-dye Adidas hat. Like I was like, yep, that's going in my collection. At this point, I could probably do a collection video of all my hats. Um, also, I might as well get these out of the way, but I am going to be redoing the pantry. It is, it's chaos in there. I mean, it's just, yeah. So I've, ar I've ordered lighting, which you might've seen like in an Amazon haul. Um, the lighting needs to change in there. I want to add a rug and I need to add some sort of organization bits. So I found a bunch of these jars at TJ Maxx. This one specifically was $2.99. It has, here's what the lid looks like. like this. So to me, this is the large. Then I got the medium. And then I also got the small, which looks like this. So, you know, let me try that again. And what I was thinking about doing with these specifically was like things like candy or um, maybe flour, sugar, rice kind of thing. I'm not entirely sure if I'm going to do that. As a matter of fact, I'm not even sure I'm going to end up using these. I could return these. And just because I really wanted to go for something very uniform, um, and I wanted to go for like a wicker bamboo look and these are not that so either they're gonna end up working out or I could end up just kind of taking them back and yeah it'll it'll really depend on when I get everything together and get it organized and kind of like see how I feel but that was my thought process and I got a bunch so I'm not gonna open them all up but you saw you saw the main sizes so so there's that. So I'm gonna get these put up over here. And then I got this one item, which I almost forgot about, but I saw it in the store and I, 
I gasped. At first, even like looking at it on the shelf, it looked like plastic. This is glass. It's absolutely stunning. I love the lemons. I love the print. And that's exactly what I'm going to put in here. Lemonade. $5.99. $5.99. What? There's that. Now the final couple of things are clothing items, which are so cute. All right. So here's what I got for my nephew. Um, I was buying six to nine months, basically. So this was $7.99. It has the little hood for the dinosaurs. Y'all. The little shorts. I can't. I can't. Buying for a boy is so fun. I mean, my whole life, like, girls. You know, my daughter, her friends. Uh, you know, all, all the things. Cheer, cheerleading. So... Doing boy stuff, like, I get to live vicariously through my brother and sister-in-law. Anyways, then I got this one, which is a set for $8.99. Two things for $8.99, and they are so cute. They seem very light, so whether they're going, like, on a stroll in their um, neighborhood. Here's this print right here with the dinosaurs again. I love the colors on this too. And then here is this set, which, oh my god, so adorable, so cute. The little like shorts overalls, I can't. With the yellow stripes, and it comes with the little socks. This was $9.99, and actually that was it. That was all that I found for him. Um, there really wasn't much that I liked in the six to nine months, um, so there's that. Now for my niece, because I'm just dying over all of this. This little dress is so gorgeous, $7.99, very simple, has the stripes, has the little ruffles, but it's the straps that just took me out. Like, look at the little yarn detail there at the end. Yeah. They do a lot of, like, outdoorsy things. They travel a lot, so... This is just gonna be a nice little dress for her not to feel hot in. Um, then I found this little set, which I need to put it, hang on, back on the hanger for, you know, full effect. No, not, not the biker shorts. I just love it. The little flowers and this like mustard yellow color with this blue combo it's like I would never have thought but it's beautiful together and then it even comes with a scrunchie I don't know I don't know if she's like you know in the scrunchie mode or not it'll be really interesting to see like if she's gonna like take to it because she's really bows clips all the things but it's such a beautiful little top the only thing I'm thinking is like this material reminds me of something that would shrink like immediately so probably needs to be washed very delicately and air dry then i found this not the purse and the the material is like a linen on it i was just like what look at this look at this a purse and look at that embroidery it is embroidered it's not a print and I love embroidery. I don't know what it is about that detail in clothing, but it's like one of my favorite things. This is Rachel Zoe, $16.99. Rachel Zoe, Rachel Zoe. And then it has the leggings. So pretty, very spring. And this top, you guys, I wish I could just pass it through the screen. This top has like multiple layers. Like it was done incredibly well and then the embroidery on the neckline is the same as the purse $16.99 like what now there was another little dress and honestly I should have got it because they had it in a 5t and they had it in a 3t they did not have it in a 4T. 
So what I'm going to do, I think, is I'm going to go back to TJ Maxx, and if that 5T is still there, I'm going to get it, and I'll show you guys, because this little dress was the prettiest thing I'd ever seen. Anyways, then I found this one. And it comes with a headband. $14.99. What? How? And it is a high-low. Can you see that? So it's got like a little train. This is giving me four-year-old Bridgerton vibes. Okay? Right? Like, they don't get to go to the, you know, to the ton parties. But... When their sisters come home and talk about it in the holes, you know, they'll be running around. Who? Who kissed who behind the chandelier? What? You go to TJ Maxx, I hope you find this dress. Because this, I mean, everything about it, there's like beautiful layers, a little slip under there. It's just gorgeous. But anyways, that's it. Here are all the little pieces. So you can kind of see them again, like this. So I got her four little pieces, and I got him three. I mean, I guess it's a total of four items as well. So those are all going to be just, you know, part of Easter. So I think that's it. I think that's the entire haul and the entire damage that I did. That said, thank you guys again so much for watching my videos, for giving my daughter all the love, all the congratulations, welcoming her to the platform. Super sweet and we're so appreciative of your, your just, your, your super kind support. So anyways, that's that. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.